Hey everybody, L here, playing Kingdom Hearts Unchained Key. It is weekend raid time. Uh, this time we're raiding the Wicked Spider here. It's got the usual 30 million HP and the 12 hour time limit to take it down. We've got the egg spawning quest here. The objectives are to one turn all enemies, don't use any continues, and to use two or more abilities. And we also have the single weekend raid board. This is the same as it always is. Uh, the two Broom Servant Medals here and here, everything else is HDLs and Moogles. We are in bonus time right now. My party has about 30% Lux up, so let's go take one of these down. 9 million HP here, we can totally do this with our Fenrir. This is the same setup that I used on the level 440 Proud Plus Quest Cannon Camel. One of my viewers mentioned this would be a raid boss killer, so here we are. It's not the most effect, uh, e efficient Lux-wise, but it does feel really good taking it down more quickly. So we're coming in here with six gauges, but not to worry. Tyree is going to fix that for us really quickly, back up to 17, and we can go about our business. Now, of course, since our illustrated Riku B is at the end of the deck, the first turn is going to be our weakest turn. And you saw without a proc there, our HD Riku did about th over 300,000 damage, which is uh, exactly one bar of health. 300,000 is one bar of health on these raid bosses. Let's see if we can do a little bit better. Mickey and Minnie hitting the attack up XL or attack boost 4. Uh, that gets close to... Sometimes it crosses 400,000 depending on the RNG. Same with the Roxas. XL on our HD Riku crosses 600,000, which is two full bars of the raid boss. So yeah, this thing is definitely a raid boss killer, alright? The total gauge cost for activating everything in the deck is about 13, but I do have ability free, or it's called a, in the NA version, no cost on my original illustrated Kyrie, so between the two Kyries, that keeps us afloat and not in danger of running out of gauges. I do have one guard up L or defense boost 3 on the first middle Tyree there. So if that happens to proc, if we get lucky with the RNG, we'll be able to take some extra turns. But we'll find out really soon if that's going to happen. Maybe with an extra turn or two, we will be able to take it down from about, like, it was over 8 million, I think, when we first started. But in case we don't get any extra turns, it's good to use the burst here. I think with over 2 million, that's about 2 turns. Okay, we've got our 1 extra turn. Let's see if we get our second free turn here. With three HP remaining, we are going to take this thing down. 
I don't think I've ever had it as close as that before. Okay, Ray defeated. Great success. 10 million damage, about 6.8 million lux for that run. I'm pretty happy with this. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like and subscribe if you've enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time.